were um, grateful. We wanted to demonstrate that. So we got this wee gift for you. Portrait of the Hierarch. Nice. Ah, oh, there's nothing really. Got oodles of them. <laughs> Just, uh, if you wouldn't mind not mentioning where you got it. All right? All right. Farewell. Assist you. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. Need some armor. Ah, Witcher! 
three tunes. Baron's not here. Rode off to find a healer. For the wife, naturally. I know. Seen what's happening outside the gates? What do you mean? Baron left me in command. Told the boys to set things right, put them in order. The new order. They're murdering and pillaging. That is the new order. And I don't give a flying fuck if you like it or not. Didn't seem to be so. He grabbed me by the boat and bam! Right in the chops. I'll tell right you. The chops. I'll tell you where the loot's at. I need a good plow. Need to talk to you. About? Uma, gonna take him with me. Gotta ask the Baron's permission. Thing is, he ain't here. Not about to ask for anything. I'm telling you, you can try to stop me. But that'd be an error. A mortal one. Think you got me shaking in my boots? You sure as hell should be. Fine. Cripple's not worth no blood. See the groom. He ought to be glad to give him up. Bugger's been eating from the feed bags. And a pleasant journey to you both. Thank you kindly. Ye seek trouble? What do you see here, Vagrant? I'm taking Uma. There ain't a... Sergeant Hartle said I could. Bring him back though, won't you? Be awful dull without him. No. Not about to bring him back. Open the door. Now. Hey, little guy. This here's Roach. She'll take us to Care Morton. Well, come on. Looks like we got company. Elf Guardian battle mounts. What do you want? The Emperor's displeased with you. Then he ought to ask somebody else for help. The Emperor does not ask anyone for anything. You will ride with us to Vitsima. Sure about that? Don't even try. Fine. Lead the way.
and the third army will sweep in from the west to take Bangli. If I may, your Imperial Majesty, our spies report that the garrison at Banglin consists almost wholly of mercenaries. Bribery, then. We stand to lose exactly no men in battle. And we stand to lose less time. Very well. Give the orders. Then set sail. As you wish. At once! Your Imperial Majesty, Yennefer. I did not have you brought here for an exchange of courtesies. Report. As you wish, Your Majesty. Siri. Well, this man is the key to finding her. I give you three solid leads. Trails as fresh as morning dew. The aid of my spies and my court sorcerers. Yet in my daughter's stead, you bring me this... monstrosity? I hope you have more to say. For your sake. Listen. I'm looking for a needle in a haystack. A needle that at any moment can... It's a difficult task, I know this. What of it? Listen to me. I rule the largest empire the world has ever known. I wage a war against the North, command men in tens of thousands, while at home the trade corporations and nobles seek to depose me. You cannot expect me to pity you the difficulty of your task. I pursued those leads you gave me. Ciri first reappeared in Skellige, with a mage, an elf. Yen knows more. The Wild Hunt tracked them down, found them there. They were forced to flee to Velen. Where they were separated. Ciri spent some time with a local warlord, a self-styled baron who... Yes, yes, I know my vassals. ...who helped her get to Novigrad, where Ciri crossed some of the city's underworld bosses. She had to flee, went back to Skellige, ran into her elf companion there. And into the wild hunt, again. Ciri and the elf fled, out to sea this time. Their boat returned to shore the next day, with only him on board. Hmm. The information appears of little use, though at least it seems you kept busy. This monstrosity might well be your daughter. Its body is the product of a curse someone hides inside it. Can you lift this curse? I've done a great deal of research, made inquiries, but to lift it I would need to know the words used to cast it, and that... Dandelion told me. Siri talked to him about it. At last, you provide a pleasant surprise. Lady Yennefer, my question stands. Yes. I believe I can, but I must... The details do not interest me. Geralt, you've achieved precious little, yet admittedly more than the bumblers in my spy corps have. I give you half the promised reward. You will receive the other when you bring me Siri. Fine. This audience is over. Till the next. Could have used some of that famous biting wit of yours. Where'd it disappear to? I mean, you were meek as a novice at Aratusa called into the Dean's office. I merely know when I can indulge my pride, and when I must swallow it. Ah, I see. So you show your claws to me because I'm a lowly witcher, but... Do you really wish to do this now, Geralt? We can fight another time, in another place, where the walls have no ears. 
So, how do we lift Uma's curse? We must take him to Kaer Morhen. Oh, and Geralt, forgive me, but I'm unable to teleport you, Uma, and Roach, so... Don't worry, we'll ride there. Never did like teleporting. Take care of yourself. Wait. Here, probably better if you keep it. Of course. I'm off. Quite a while. Too long. And your journey, how was it? Calm, if you don't count the forked tail that flew over our heads a few miles back. Passenger got a little restless. Hmm. What have we here? Multiple deformities. Eyes, ears, nostrils, a hair lip. And is this... Now, now, calm down. Jennifer was right on one count. Thing sure isn't pretty. Don't look all that nice yourself. How'd you get so dirty? Huh? Ah, this. I was mixing some lime for the mortar. Need to patch up the walls before they crumble. A lot of work for one person. Lambert and Eskel not willing to help? Don't see the sense in it? No. Yennefer found more important things for them to do. Yen's here already? And how? Huh. You two argue? Geralt, I understand she's a... Well, how do I put this? Emancipated, strong-willed woman. But do manners count for nothing? She teleports in, not even a nice to see you, jumps right into a we've a curse to live, there's this to do and that. So Eskel and Lambert get going. And she went to the guest room to rearrange things, through the bed, off the balcony. Shame. That was a good bed. Said the same myself. Solid oak frame, down mattress. Triss always said she... Ah, now I see. It's either that, or Yen really hates oak furniture. So what's Yen planning? Wish I knew. Mean she didn't tell you? She told us what she needs to lift the curse, not what she plans to do with it, despite our asking. She's gotta have a good reason. Huh. More than one, most likely. In any case, she's set her mind on something. Needs us to stay out of her way, mostly. So where is everyone? Eskel's hunting fork tails. Gotta nip that infestation in the bud. And since Yennefer needs to distill some ingredients from their organs, well, like they say, two birds, one stone. Lambert's still in the keep, preparing to venture into the mountains to enrich the phylactery with elemental power. Mm -hmm. And Yen? 
Assembling a megascope. Wanted my help running around with some chirping contraption, searching for something. But I'm too old for that nonsense. I should let her know I'm here. If you say so, but don't go thinking she'll throw her arms around your neck. this? Brewing potions? No. Booze from potato peels. Hmm. For my welcome back feast? Actually more like my farewell feast. Haven't heard? Madame Sorceress has requested I fortify the phylactery with power from the Circle of Elements. Says it's essential to lifting the curse from that monstrosity of yours. Don't sound too thrilled about all this. I'm not. You know the trek to the Circle's no walk in the park, in more ways than one. Let me go with you. Well, might have more spring in my step with the famous white wolf at my side. So, you ready? Gotta take care of something. Wait for me. Sure. Everything's ready at my end. No reason to wait. Let's go. Oh, meant to tell you. Can't get to the circle through the mountains. Rockslide blocked the pass last spring. So we approach from the pond side, like when we did the trial of the medallion? Exactly. Remember the way? Not easily forgotten that. He who returns with his medallion will prove himself worthy and may set off on the path. Vesemir ever hear you impersonate? Sibola's breach. Still haven't patched it up? Vesemir'd like to. Doesn't bother me, though. Not expecting anyone to lay siege, and... This way I got a shortcut to the pond. Shame those Salamandra assassins didn't punch a few more holes in our walls. Or finish the job and reduce these ruins to rubble. No, I got a boat moored there. You know, for fishing. Wow. Never took you for the fishing type. I use bombs. I drop them in and scoop up whatever floats to the surface. Huh. That makes sense. Old master down in Zarakania. Yeah. Save that tail for your next sorceress.
tell me about Vesemir. Things any better between you? Seems so. Old man's dropped the moralizing, and I try not to piss him off too. Mm -hmm. Working out well? Moderately. Castle's pretty big. Easy to stay out of each other's way. Damn it! I moored it right here, I swear! Line must have come loose. Really? Here I thought the boat untied itself to go for a jaunt on its own. Damn it. In this fog, we'll never... There a storm before I arrived? Let me think. Yeah, five days passed. Hmm. Wind must have grabbed the sail, tugged the boat off its mooring. Boat drifted into the bushes. Thing we need. All right. Cave entrance is just opposite. See it? Gotta sail across the pond, go through the cave, climb Troll's head, and we're there. Doesn't seem like such an ordeal now, does it? No. Still gives me the shivers, though. You know only two boys returned from my group? You were the ones who ran into old spear tip in the caverns, right? Mm-hmm. That's still gnawing at you? Gnawing? No. Straight old pisses me off. What the fuck was that trial for? Most who returned from the Circle of Elements died within a year in some swamp, hunting drowners for Crown 30 ahead. So exactly what was the point? Ought to ask Vesemir. Oh, I have. Many times. Believe you me. Let's go. Jump in the boat. All right. I'm taking the tiller, though. Because? Because it's my boat. Not up for discussion. Yourself? Yeah. Something you don't like about it? Besides the water up to our ankles? Nothing. Quit whining. It'll make it across the lake. Provided we don't smash into something first. Barely see the tip of my nose. Fog's thick as curdled milk. Never took you for a poet. Oh, but I am one. Wanna hear a limerick? Sure. Lambert, Lambert, what a prick. Not bad. Fall off a bit. Sails fluttering. Don't teach your grandma to suck eggs. Right, almost there. Ready for the caverns? Almost. Before we go inside. Ugh, drink a dose of cat, I know. Any more words of wisdom? Like, 
Step softly or you'll wake old spear tip. Old spear tip still down there? Yeah, he is. Unless he's done us a favor and killed over on his own. Could come at us at any moment. How'd the rhyme go? Old spear tip's a deep sleeper. Wake him up and you'll sleep deeper. Come on. Hear that? Sounds like a kid. You know this valley's uninhabited except for us. It's gotta be an illusion. What if it's not? <laughs> Whatever you want to do. We'll investigate, just in case. You know, Vesemir's right. You do poke the damn hive, almost always. Fine. Let's go. Hey, little guy. Ah! It's all right, you're safe now. No! No! Help! Fine. Consider yourself vindicated. You were right. Well, well, what do you know? We can talk about that later. Got the foglets to take care of now. Ah, uh, that stench. Time soon, are you? No, I will not. In fact, whole world should hear about the time the famed Geralt of Rivia was duped like a child. Think we ought to get Dandelion to write a ballad about it. How's that sound? When someone's life might be threatened, I'd rather be safe than sorry. Enough said. Of course, the noble white wolf never abandons a man in need. He's more saint than Witcher. Changing subjects. Did I see right? Was that boy... Yeah, one of ours. Must have drowned during his trial. Foglitz remembered his voice and appearance. Charming. Let's get out of here. Needn't ask me twice. In fact, I didn't even want to come here. Lambert, enough. Not if I give you a boost. Remember? Part of the trials. A witcher is a lone hunter. But even a lone hunter can use a helping hand sometimes. Vesemir. Ready? Oh! You fat fuck! One, two, three! You're no feather either. Come on, let's go. Hmm. Oh. Wall looks a little shaky. Ard mind not stomping like that. Relax, I slipped. Something fell in my eye. 
splinter, I think. Hope it wasn't from a broken mirror. That'd make you even nastier. Ha ha. reeks of mold. What did you expect? Scent of violets? Would have been nice. Ah, so soft and sweet, just sleeping there. Makes you want to make this moment last forever. Good to be back above ground. Mm-hmm. Still trouble ahead. You mean the trolls? They're in for trouble, not us. Don't know who you're trying to impress. Tough guy stuff's just not working on me. <laughs> Look who's talking. Vesemir told me about that job you did for those Nilf Guardians in Velen. What? What are you doing? Killing. Monsters. <laughs> Good one. Just came out that way. Come on. Ha! <laughs> See him shit and run as soon as he saw us? Mm -hmm. Never known a troll to do that. Just is to walk no more. The stops? Yeah. East Mountain. Trolley Mountain. Troll Mountain. Huh? Oh. Uh, hi! This Troll Mountain. Ah. Uh, you talk to these idiots. Stay calm. We just want to get to the circle. Which is this thing one say? Thing two do. Thing three do. Sometime. Ah, uh, enough! Out of my way, dimwits, or I'll grind you to gravel. Understand? <laughs> mm-hmm. They understood all right. Congrats. Run for the cave! Before they stone us to death! Which is his understanding? We understand it, but we still gotta get to the Circle of Elements. Listen, but we. Trolls come know to Witcher's Castle. Lock Slotfler. Let him rock. Enjoying this little chat? Cause, uh, it's not getting us anywhere. I'm talking. Fact is, you know as much about negotiating as they do about grammar. We're not here to hurt you. We don't want to touch your rocks. Just let us pass. Troll, rock, troll. Witcher see strike no back. Just talky, talky. Witcher, wood? Only you. Witcher says monster kills trolls, monsters. Yes, true is. No face, mate. To go this. You shall back clubs leave here. You pass. No quiz. We smash. No way. Witcher without his sword, it'd be like losing an arm. 
Better arm loose than head. Just a few steps more, and we're there. Ooh, that's some serious panting. Out of breath, out of shape. Well, we made it. No denying that. Damn. Beautiful view. We can soak it in later. Of course. Duty before pleasure. Remember how this circle works? Been a while since I activated my medallion here. It's fine, old man. No need to make excuses. Light the torches and place the phylactery on the altar. I'll handle the rest. How'd it go? Water, then earth, then air? Then all we gotta do is wait. The container will absorb the power of the elements while we catch a breather. So, how'd you deal with the trolls when you passed the trial of the medallion? Let me think. Oh yeah, used Axie. But I only had to get past one troll. Other two were busy. Yeah, useful sign, Axie. Saved my life a short while ago. Sense a good story coming. One of the best. A couple of road robbers stopped me. One pointed a crossbow at me, and the other started rummaging through my satchel. And made the man with the crossbow shoot his friend, and then hang himself. Wow. Truly great story. Isn't it? Real side-splitter, I think. Tell me, you always been such a cynical bastard? No. I was adorable before Vesemir brought me to care more him. We all went through it. That's just it. Not everyone made it. Lots of boys died here. Boys taken against their will. It was our destiny. Destiny? Let me tell you about destiny. My dad was a drunk. He'd knock a few back, then beat me and Mom bloody. We prayed for his death every night. One day our prayers were almost answered. Dad lost his way coming home from the tavern, walked smack into a nest of neckers. But some witcher saved him. Know what he wanted in return? Give me the first thing you see when you get home. My life. For the life of that prick? I say fuck that kind of destiny. Know what? Let's get out of here. Don't like what you're hearing, huh? Witchers shouldn't talk like that. Know what else you won't like? After the trial of the medallion, I rode straight home to thank my daddy for everything. Want to hear what I did to him? Lambert, please. Thought we were opening up, having an honest talk. 
But fine, let's continue pretending everything's just peachy. The road beckons, my good man. Our companions await. Right, let's get back. After you, sir. What about? You haven't changed a lick. That disappointment I hear? No. Surprise, maybe. Most grow gentler with age. Seems you're growing pricklier. Mom always said I was different. Had some other adjectives in mind, but different will do. Nice to be together again, wouldn't you say? Mm-hmm. Just missing Siri. Thanks for reminding me. I had to change the subject. Heard a sentimental sob making its way up from your gut. 
Any idea why she's returned? Shortest version, she's running from the wild hunt. Damn. Going gets tough and you need help, you can count on me. See you later. Yeah, take care. Yes? What is it, Wolf? I met with Amir. Any crowned heads you haven't met? A few. Hoping it stays that way. Remember the first war with Nilfgaard? Battle of Sodden? The North, all of it, fought together. Tamaria, Redania, Cadwin, Hedon. And the mages were heroes. On the field first, then in ballads. Not much left of that world. See you later, Vesemir. Can we talk? I'm looking for Ciri. Ashen hair, scar on her cheek. Seen her? How can I help you? You think universals exist as real and distinct entities, or only as mental constructs? Mm -hmm. So do I. So long.
made of silver. 